You're listening to the Genomics Minute, brought to you by Genome British Columbia. So I'm Jean-Francois Deleuze. I'm from France, where I am heading the center, National Center for Sequencing. So um, from your experience in France, um, do you think BC should consider centralizing or kind of decentralizing our sequencing and bioinformatics capacity? Uh, it, it's an important question, you know. Uh, Economically wise, we should centralize, but if you want to get the adoption about all the, the stakeholders, you know, you should decentralize. And this is the option we take, we took in France. So we will be building, you know, 12 sequencing centers to make sure that, you know, we'll get all the hospitals on board. But, you know, for, for bioinformatics and for all the data, we will have a centralized, um, what you call CAD for collecting and uh, analyzing data that will be national, but you know, that will be accessible to everyone at any time. And um, another question that uh, often comes up is the debate over the clinical application of genomics in BC. And what's your opinion as to whether we should kind of always push for whole genome sequencing or whether it's more appropriate and more commonly to go for gene test panels or exome sequencing? Technically wise, you know, uh, with whole genome you get information that you could get with exome and gene panels. So the only problem you get, you have today is that, you know, uh, genome sequencing is still costly. It's, you know, uh, something like 1,000 one euro or dollar when, you know, gene panel can be half of that and an exome is half of that. But on, on the quality and the data, you know, exome will provide you with everything. So I guess this is, a, this is also something, a discussion we have internally in, in the French program. And I guess, you know, we are moving towards, you know, whole genome for quite everything. Uh, and when the whole genome will be really, really cheap and cheaper than it is today, definitely, I guess the question will not even be on the table anymore. Uh, final question for today. There's still kind of major issues around biobanking and also kind of storage of data. So in your opinion, um, what should we do to produce better tools and methods for kind of data harmonization, standardization, and sharing across multiple biobanks and multiple databases? You know, I guess, I guess you, know, you, you say the right, the right words. You know, what do we need is standardization. And I guess one of the, big, the biggest problems we have in, when, we, when we try to make uh, meta-analysis and we want to share data is that one of the big, the big source of heterogeneity is, uh, is the preparation of the sample by themselves. So I don't know what tool do we need, but we need absolutely to standardize all processes, whether it's DNA extraction, error extraction, uh, freezing, stuff and thumb. Definitely it has to be the same everywhere. And for the tool, I don't, I don't even know if they are easy tool to be used and, and again, accept, acceptable by the community. Mm -hmm.